Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Nerd Doctors. My name is Griffin. I'm joined with my co-host, Edward. What's up, guys? Episode 4 of Loki was just released, and if you saw our last video on Episode 3, we're, we were expecting some sort of curveball as pretty much the entire season story can really be concluded in this one episode. And I gotta say, I think the show's starting to lose me. I don't know about you, Edward, or about what you guys think, but Loki's starting to lose me a bit. I'm not as invested. I don't really feel the stakes as much, or neither the intrigue. It just seems... They're definitely telling the story that they want to tell. It's just not one that I'm super interested in, just because the world's supposed to be ending. Like, the entire multiverse is supposed to be ending. I'm just not really feeling it yeah damn that's weird man i'm i'm digging it it is I'm glad slow. you are <laughs> it, it is it is slow this this episode was a little bit faster for me than last week's episode um I've, I've, there's a couple of fucked up things that happened in this episode i can't yeah. some people died i'll say that i can't i won't <laughs> say when or how but some people die in a very fucked up way <laughs> i thought that was we don't see it but, some, well, but that's a perfect example. Sometimes I don't need to see it to know it was fucked up. But I one thing with that is that was that whole scene is way too convenient. That how that how, how that was entirely set up just doesn't make any sense to me. It was way too convenient. Yeah, I just I, I was in the moment and the sounds and the expression on a character's face. Again, I I won't spoil it for you guys. If you haven't seen the episode, go watch it. Yeah. Um, but I'm 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 digging it. I, I do get what Griffin is saying. There there are some things that you can we know what this is. This is set up for you know, fucking Secret, Secret Wars, Wars. King Wars. Dynasty. We, we, yeah. we, we, we know what this is. But still, <clears throat> and this is surprising because I I, you guys are gonna be like fuck Edward. <laughs> I didn't care for Loki season. I sat through it because I mean I did. I also sat through fucking She Hulk. Um, but I didn't. I just there wasn't one episode of Loki season. And I know there's Loki season fan hardcore fans out there who are like Edward's shit. But I'll I just say that I enjoyed it. season one. Season one was good. Yeah. <laughs> but but this one I don't know if if maybe my bar was set way low. It could be that. I'm thinking um, so. <laughs> But I'm 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 digging it. It's not one of my favorite shows, uh, but I'm hoping that the the last two episodes pick up and 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 really yeah. leave us like oh shit, you know? Because I'm already I, in in angst for Secret Wars, of yeah, King Dynasty, and all that shit. I I'm turning into Edward. I'm not <laughs> I'm not looking forward to the next two episodes because I don't think. What they have set up is going to be exciting. The episode, this episode ended on a cliffhanger. Most of these episodes have been ending on some sort of loose cliffhanger. I do get that because I, I was like, I thought there was something wrong with my power or some shit. Yeah, because they had like three like, seconds of black screen before credits. Wait, what rolled. the fuck? Well, so I do think that was good, but I think how it ended just proves there's nothing else after this moment. There's nothing else surprising coming up because, okay, yeah, this moment came, but I think if they, because we've been talking about this, the curveball, we've been talking about this curveball for, for, for a couple of episodes now, if they revealed the curveball, which is coming at the end of this episode, it would have had me invested. But the way this one ended just on that black screen, it's just, sh to me, it tells me that they don't have anything else this is the most draw dropping thing they could do. And it's just it wasn't it for me. Yeah, I see that. Cuz it, 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 it was too long. It was it was a, a it was 51 like minute episode, yeah. No, no, no. I meant I meant like the black screen thing. Oh, yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I was like, wait a minute. I know I paid my fucking It has to be done intentionally, right? That that there's no way yeah, that wasn't no... intentional. <clears throat> and um I hope he's wrong. He is becoming me though cuz he I hope he I'm now... wrong too. He now wants Luke Skywalker and you know and other characters <laughs> that I've always wanted um, in Star Wars a lot more as to where before he was like fuck this yeah um, but we'll see. I mean I like um, Ravana. it can be good yeah it, it can yeah. still be really she's good my, she's my Loki crush <laughs> yeah no I, I, I have I, a lot I know most you know people that know me are gonna be like fuck Edward you have a crush on every show 
I really hope the last two episodes wow me. It is losing me just because I, I'm thinking more and more. This is just a launching point. Doesn't really have a conclusion. That is true. I mean, yeah, we. I knew that from episode one, but I'm. Well, okay. yeah, but like, I still wanted a conclusion and a launching point. You can definitely do that. Like, this I still just. I think we may get one. I hope. I, so. I still think we definitely can. It's just based off how the story's going. It seems to just be dragged out a little bit. And there's a couple of scenes that okay, we do get some touching moments with characters, but if they were removed, we still would have had the same development, same relationships. They weren't really adding anything. I'm hoping the last two episodes prove me wrong. Cause the acting is still great. The characters are still great. It's just more of just the writing and the plot and the story. It's not really thrilling me. But it definitely can. It it definitely can, because there's a lot of stuff they can do. They just need to do it next episode. They can't do it at the end of episode six, because at that point, it's just going to be cheap. Because six episodes were leading up to just this cheap moment to set up a two-hour movie. When you had four out, not four hours, you had six hours to set that up, and you could have done it just better. But we'll see. I really hope see, I'm wrong. I, 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 I would say that that's not going to happen, because you know they're course-correcting. However... This is Loki before the course would, yeah, correction. That's 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 the thing. Yeah, so oh. Marvels is the last project before the course correction. So I'm fine if those two these two projects are shit. After that, they're they're on their I last. I hope shot. the Marvels isn't shit because that means yeah that pretty much means by Brie Larson if that movie's shit. Rumor is she wants to leave the role anyway. So who knows? Marvel has been going through a lot of changes lately. Yeah. I'm hoping they can pick it up, especially with their new changes. Fingers crossed that's good. I'm I'm a diehard Marvel fan and I really want to see him continue. You guys already know I'm I'm deep shit in Marvel. I just yeah. got my, my Daredevil tattoo and it's badass. So you don't you don't go get ink on you if you if you're a casual fan. Yeah. I mean I guess you could, but that's weird as fuck. Like if you're hardcore, yeah, you're gonna go, you know, get get that on you. Um so yeah, no, we both love. I've said it numerous times. My home is DC, but DC's fucking. You know, they're going through Noah's Ark over there right now. <laughs> um, yeah. and 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 Marvel. Yeah, I I I never got those fans that were like, "Fuck you, dude." I'm I'm strictly DC or F you, man. I'm 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 hardcore Marvel. I never got that either. Why, well, yeah, why the fuck would you miss out on that, man? Why yeah. would you miss out on both of these? They, you know, they got some of the best storytelling. I've never, I, I've never gotten those people like, no, fuck Spider Man. I'm only Batman. Why? Why <laughs> at would that you point, miss I out? think people are just hating just to hate. Honestly, if that's your thing, go for it. I'm gonna go be happy over here. I'm gonna enjoy yeah, both. No, I, everyone I, can I, do you it. Know, it's like people that are like, fuck Lord of the Rings. I'm only Star Wars. I've never heard that one. <laughs> I do shit. <laughs> Sound off on the comments, guys. No, I. You'd be surprised. A lot of my friends are like, "What are you watching?" I'm like, "Oh, because you know, Griff and I went through yeah. our Lord of the Rings. They're like, why, why are you watching Lord of the? Why the fuck wouldn't I? They're great movies." Yeah, but you're a Star Wars fan. I totally forgot we reviewed that. Yeah, but you know, you just <laughs> miss out on stuff. But uh, anyway, off off topic. I I enjoyed this episode. I has there been an episode on on Loki thus far that I've that I thought was shit. No, I don't think so. No. Just me. Yeah. Which is funny because with Ahsoka, <laughs> there was that one episode where I was like, the next one better bring it. I have some theories about what happens next. I'm just really hoping it's not a dragged out two hours and they're just doing it just to fill content and not really getting any character development, any story development or anything. Yeah, we'll see. Okay. I mean, I'm still a big Marvel fan. Like we've been saying, I, I'll be there. <laughs> Oh, Regardless yeah. of this even channel this or is, not, <laughs> even if any of this stuff is ass, we're still gonna be here. Um, yeah. Join us next time, guys, for Five Nights at Freddy's. Please, I hope that movie doesn't suck. We'll see. Let us know what you guys think about this show in the comments.